All right, all right. Another special episode. Of course, they're all wonderful and special of the Andrew Splice Clay Show. And today on the show, we are going to explore zip lines, Korean fuck swings, and crotch gallows. Now, I should preface by saying that we all know that sex is a wonderful, dirty, filthy, disgusting, special thing. Okay, and sometimes it goes outside of traditional lines. And the introduction of variables, if you will, that can be people or food stuff items or uh, restraint uh, devices and so forth. Uh, uh, I, I myself prefer the suspension devices. Okay, now a zip line is pretty self-explanatory, right? You got the thing up, you're cocked up, legs in the sky, cock first, you're flying into a pile of ass. Okay, that's fairly self-explanatory. It's something that requires a little bit of coordination uh, in terms of the execution of it, but it's fun to continue to learn through the process of trial and error. All right, now, on to number two. The Korean fuck swing. Oh, man, this is fantastic. All right, so it's it's got the suspension to where you get them, you know, one leg going towards Los Angeles, the other one going towards New York set up. But behind them, it's got this device that allows their torso to be suspended and rotate while the legs are splayed, right? So you get a scenario where you get them up, you insert, right, and you just... Spin the legs like a propeller. And you're fucking laid back while the spinning's going on like fucking Michael Jackson in that video. Ah! Wind going through your fucking hair, right? It's fantastic. Korean fuck swing, right? Make sure you, you know, watch a fucking Bob Villa video or Adam Carolla's real good with shit like that. So that you assemble the thing correctly, because, you know, you wouldn't want an accident to happen. Uh, now, the third one, the, the crotch gallows. Okay, this is essentially a box with a hole in it that holds the applicable crotch. In my case, it's a chick. Holds the applicable crotch bent at the waist, covers the waist, and goes a little bit up the thigh, leaving the crotch splayed and exposed. And you can flip it. It could be ass up, ass down, right? Facing the muff, right? And this is, you know, she's on the other side. Who knows what the fuck's going on over there? It's the mystery that adds to the intrigue and to the rush. And meanwhile, you're just, uh, uh, you could fucking care less what she's doing. Over there, she could be in a fucking coma for Christ's sake. Whatever, you know, playing fucking Candy Land, whatever the fuck, on some video game, whatever, right? But you got it's everything's under control because you got the crotch gallows, and you're just chilling. Oh, crotch in a box, oh, ass in a box, right? It's fantastic. It's wonderful. All right, now again. Please use the proper precaution and engineering techniques when utilizing these wonderful uh, tools of suspension and gravity and quasi-restraint, these uh, splaying, spreading aids, as it were, uh, to make your experience that much more enjoyable. Um, I'm Andrew Splice Clay. Thank you for tuning in to the show. Um, hope to have many more, and if not, everything's all the same. Shut your mouth and go fuck yourself. <laughs>